hello everyone in this video we will see how can we sort the characters of an array in alphabetic order so let's see one sample input output sample input output we will see like uh, suppose if i have entered and if i have entered a string apple then how should it be displayed because in apple what is the uh, Alphabetically, which character will come first? A will come, next E will come, and then next L will come, and then P. So, uh, this is what input, and this is what output. It means that in this program, we have to accept the word and we have to display the word's letter in alphabetic order. So, let's begin the program. Let's see how can we do that. Okay, so first of all, our first line of the program will be import java.util.scanner then after we will create the class after the creation of class we have to give any name to the class so here I am giving the name as okay sort care sort care any name can be given so it should not be a keyword then after we have public static void main the main function of the program then next step is to create the object of scanner class scanner class object is created then after we will ask user to input a string so we want a word to be given as input so we will simply give a message here system dot out dot print ln enter a word will take a word from user okay and we will store this word in a string variable so we will write here string s equal to ob dot next next method is used to take a word from user so input is taken now our next work is to convert this into an character array so that's why i'm declaring here char and uh, array name has to be given suppose if I have given the name as AR and here that string will be converted to an array there is a method to char array which converts a string into an array so now this has become a character array whatever the input is taken it has converted back into an array now we will use the bubble sorting method to sort the letters of the string into alphabetic order so for that we will run two loops so kindly see carefully so we'll begin from here for int i equal to zero and it should go lesser than the length so we'll write here ar dot length okay now then after we will write here i plus plus then after the second loop that begins that has to be begin from 0 again and that should be ar dot length minus i minus 1 and then j plus plus okay first loop will go from 0 to length lesser than length means the complete characters means it will run suppose there are five characters then it will go from 0 to 4 second loop that it begins from 0 but it will go lesser than length and then the value of the current value of i and minus 1 this is the uh, the running of the loop for bubble sorting now it, it is time to check each and every character if the character which is at the j position that is the current value of j if it is greater if it is greater than j plus 1 so actually we have taken a sample input so I'll take that here it was a p p l e 0 1 2 3 4 it was this was now these two will be uh, checked if a is uh, uh, greater than p so a is not greater than p so swapping will not happen okay so now we will write if it is true if this character 
is greater than this character j is greater than j plus 1 then there will be swapping so we have to write the code for swapping so uh, suppose i have declared before a loop um, <coughs> a character variable character c okay so i can here write i will store the if it is true then what we have to do the character at the j position will be stored in c temporarily and then next what we will do we will write here a r j in that what we will store the character which is at the next position that will be stored and again back into that j plus one which is at the next c will be stored so so if it is greater the next character is uh, is lesser than this character then only the swapping will be done as i told that here in this case uh, a is not greater so swapping will not be done okay now if it is greater then only swapping will be done and here we close our loop and at the end of the loop what we have to do we will simply write system dot out dot print and what to be printed uh, print ln also we can write and we will that uh, print that array this so in this way sorting can be done the characters of the uh, string can be sorted in alphabetic order